Hi guys, a uh, quick video about this uh, vintage Burroughs calculator I just received from eBay. So it is a Burroughs C3155 from 1970, guys. It is 34 years old and as you can see, it is in absolutely great condition. In fact, I just clean it because it was a little dirty, but really nothing to say so here is the front uh, keyboard very strong mechanical keyboard the display is made of individual uh, VFD tubes early VFD in uh, individual tubes like uh, Nixes here you have a nice Burroughs plate at the back here you have cleaning instructions on the manufacturer plate serial number is uh, 11064 mm -hmm. so 11,000 uh, of them were made it seems made in Japan of course at the bottom here you have an interesting uh, sticker about uh, the use excuse me you cannot see it here the use of um, ISO screws metric ISO screws so the nice thing with this calculator is the very unique uh, shape of the uh, numbers when you turn it on. So first, as you can see, they light up. So the zero numbers are only half digit height, eight, and uh, you cannot type straight away from uh, turning it on. First, you have to press the C button. For some reasons, it uh, writes uh, 32. And when you press another time C, now it is uh, ready. So you have uh, something particular, the plus, uh, the multiply and the divide key is the same. And uh, you select which one by the, by the equal key. So if I want to do, uh, for instance, uh, 45 divided by 5. I have to press the minus key and it gives me the result on the left digit. So I will show you the fun shape of the numbers. In fact, they are really, really nice. As you can see, the round numbers are very uh, comfortable to read. So I will check online if there are any internal photos available. I will link them if I find them. If not, I will probably make another video showing you the internals. It is using four gold ceramic IC clips with 1970 decals on them. There is a nice box, metal box around the power supply, so it is completely separated from the other parts. There is the individual display tubes with small uh, ICs in a plastic box, very special shape of uh, IC for uh, driving them it seems. So it will be all for now, just one more thing. I have the original dust cover in, uh, in uh, not in liver, in plastic. But for some reason, oddly enough, it is too small. So I, either I did shrink with uh, years, or in fact it is from another Burroughs calculator of a little uh, smaller uh, form factor, and they were mixed at some point. Maybe if uh, an office did have several uh, Burroughs calculator, because you, you, there is no way you put it on over the calculator. It is quite uh, weird. Uh, I will not complain because I got it for 10 euros on eBay with 10 for shipping and I, uh, I have seen other ones for sale more than 100 dollars on uh, US eBay so I think it is a pretty good deal and as I am recording something else probably you remember my uh, video about the Toshiba vintage Toshiba calculator here is another one I received, I saw. 
It is almost the same. This one is model BC0804B. The main difference is the, it has uh, removable batteries. You can either use uh, AA batteries or uh, accumulators. And here there is a little indicator for the battery charge, but it is the only thing not working on the calculator. I can turn it on uh, with no problem, it is working fine. But this thing does not move, so maybe it is uh, stuck in some way. But as it is uh, an enclosed uh, module, I cannot uh, open it without damaging it. There is the same uh, power plug. We need to apply it from Toshiba here. So it is a little later model, it must be from 72, 73, something like this. And something nice, I have also the user manuals, both in uh, English and French. So this is a cheap uh, French translation and German also. But on the uh, nicer uh, English one, there is some uh, corrections made with sticking and I'm not sure you will see it on camera. But uh, this line here, they did uh, stick a piece of paper with uh, corrected uh, uh, writings here also. They did correct the uh, user manual by uh, replacing here. They did uh, mask some uh, decimal numbers. So instead of uh, reprinting the whole uh, manual, they prefer to also to correct the manual with a sticking, probably by hand, because there is no way a robot does it in uh, 1782. So for this first line here, it must have been a pretty tedious uh, job. Quite interesting, nice uh, photo here from the device. Printed in Japan, of course. So, it is my uh, all of uh, vintage calculators for this week. I am still uh, checking eBay regularly to see if I can find them uh, some cheap because if you, some models are just becoming crazy expensive as the uh, vintage Hewlett Packards. But sometimes you can still find uh, very good deals. So, thanks for watching. Bye bye.